Hi everyone, it's me, Jonathan. I thought I would do a video for you guys. Um, I haven't done one in a while and I miss you all, um, so I hope you're all doing well. Um, just another bad video and I kind of have a little funny story almost. Um, so, <clears throat> I went to Starbucks today um, and I got the Boleto. Oh, sorry, I definitely butchered that. Um, whew, my Italian ancestors are crying. Um, but it's the one with like the oil in it. Um, <clears throat> well, first of all, I only bought it because like Starbucks was doing like, if you buy one, then you get like 200 stars or whatever with it. Um, and so I was like, okay, I never have gotten it just because I heard really horrible things about it. And let me tell you, it is like the nastiest thing ever. Like, I took one sip of it, and I'm like, nope, I can't, I can't do it. Not at all. So I'm actually saving some for my sister, because I want to see if she'll try it. Um, just because of how horrible it is. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, anyways. And then also, while I was waiting in line, um, you know, I'm just talking with the, the Starbucks um, cashier. Um, barista, the one who does like the, the drive through and whatnot. And then she's like, oh wow, I, I like your jacket and stuff. And I'm like, oh yeah, you too. And of course, you know, she's not wearing a jacket. So I'm just like, oh my gosh. Like you see all those like funny memes and reels and stuff of that. I'm just like, it's me. I, I can't. I don't know. It's like so great ingrained in you that you just, you just have to say it regardless, you know? Um, so maybe it's just me, but I just thought that was funny. But anyways, this is the jacket, in case you're actually curious about it. So I did get this one at, I think it was the Coach Outlet, maybe? So I don't know if it is actually a Coach Outlet um, jacket piece, or I don't really know. I don't really have a whole lot of actual like Coach clothing, just like bags and stuff, but absolutely love this jacket. Um, Really glad I got it. I got it on sale too. So honestly, in the grand scheme of things, for it to be um, denim, it really wasn't that much. It was maybe, I think I got it definitely under like $200, um, which denim coach jacket, I think is a very good price. Um, so absolutely love this one. Um, I've been wearing it um, off and on, um, but it's been a little warm, so it's a little bit hotter. Warm and hotter, yes, obviously. Um, so I haven't really been able to wear as much, um, but definitely um, more towards the fall and everything, I will. It is a little bit cooler and chilly. It has been for the last couple days um, where I live. Uh, so, you know, I get to bust it out a little bit. Well, anyways, that's um, my story-esque time. Um, so, oh, and I got this really cute shirt from Old Navy. It has like a little goal on it. Um, and if you know me, I love birding. I love birds. Um, obsessed. Um, maybe I could do like a come bird with me kind of day. That would be kind of fun. Um, or I could show you like, I have like a Sibley. Um, I could show you all the ones I've seen and whatnot. Um, that might be kind of fun as well. Um, so yeah, let me know what you guys think about that. But love birds. Well, anyways, it just says no fry left behind, and it has the a goal on it, and it just says the boardwalk cleanup crew and everything. And I just thought it was really cute. Um, and it was pretty cheap, just that old navy and whatnot. Um, because I was getting my Fourth of July um classic T-shirt to wear. Um, so super excited about that. Not that I have any plans or anything. Um, <laughs> but. If I do get plans, then I am prepared. Okay, do the bag. Um, so this is definitely a forever bag for me. Um, not just because of the price, um, but I absolutely love it. I think it's classy, elegant, even though it kind of reminds me of a trash bag. Um, but this is from Mark Cross. Um, I have another couple Mark Cross pieces. I like the, um, I think two crispy bags um this one and then i have the like the gray spots bag so let me know if you want to do like 
um, see like a coat, uh, not coach, uh, gosh, um, a Mark Cross um, bag collection video. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think on that. Um, so here she is in her dust bag. Got to keep her safe. Um, I do have stuff in it because I did use it uh, yesterday. Um, but here she is. This is the um, the mini scarf bag, I believe is what it's called. Um, and I absolutely love it. I think this is made out of calf leather. Um, I did get the white. Um, right now it's currently 50% off. So I want to say originally this retails for about sixteen hundred or something, and right now it's like you know eight hundred or so, which is still you know kind of steep. But um, if you know Mark Cross, I feel like it's I really hate the term quiet luxury because that's literally what everybody's like saying and whatever. Um, but if you like a bag that really has very minimal branding. But it's very classic um, and just something that you, you would you could keep forever kind of thing and that it will never go out of style which honestly to me if you like something then just buy it and wear it whether or not it's quote unquote in style or not I mean it's 2023 like I don't I just don't understand it it's like um, if other people get so offended, it's not like they're the ones wearing it, you know, kind of thing. Um, but anyway, so this is the, the mini um, scarf bag. Um, I believe this is what, calf leather. Um, and I absolutely love it. Um, I kind of wish I got the bigger size. Um, but I still love this one and I will keep it absolutely forever and ever and ever and ever until it falls apart. But yeah, definitely, if you like very understated, amazing, amazing craftsmanship. I'm talking about, this is like pinnacle of, you know, American luxury. Um, definitely check out their stuff. I know you can get them um, for decent prices on like your, your third party, you know, kind of reseller type stuff. You can get them for a pretty good price if you just, you know, look around and everything. So... Um, just their craftsmanship is so amazing and their leather is so supple and I just I love all my Mark Cross pieces and I don't think I'm ever going to give those ones up kind of thing. Um, so very smooth um, zipper and whatnot. Um, it's just pretty much one big open compartment and then I have like my Mark Cross um, little thing right there. Um, I do have this is a, a coach pouch. Um, this is like the zodiac sign thing, so um, I am a Pisces. Um, I don't know what that entails, because I'm not super big into that. Um, but I have that, and then I have um, some hand sanitizer. Um, I have some Tiger Balm, um, some chapstick, um, Listerine, mouth strips, um, and then like a Bath and Body Works. Um, Oh, no, just kidding. It's Burt's Bees uh, hand cream. This is the orange blossom and pistachio. Um, but I absolutely love, 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 love this pouch. Um, I don't know. I feel like the leather is a little bit different than some other um, coach ones. Um, but absolutely love this one. It's probably my favorite. Um, oh, well. Then I have um, some sunglasses. Um, this has um, the... Bergamo, Bergamo, but these aren't actually Bergamo, um, sunglasses are actually MCM wrap glasses I got at, I think, Nordstrom Rack, so they didn't actually have the case, so they just gave me a, pretty much a random case, but, um, here they are, um, they're actually very, very cheap, <laughs> um, so that's why I bought them, um, I think, got them for maybe 50 bucks, and I know they, their retail price is probably around like 250 or something like that. Um, but just a nice pair of <clears throat> uh, just plastic sunglasses. Um, those. Um, I do have um, my uh, Chanel Blue. Um, cologne, thank you. Um, and then I also, because this bag is so big, I did carry some deodorant too. 
Um, especially if I'm, depending on what I'm wearing, I can become a very sweaty boy. Um, so sometimes I do like to bring a stick of deodorant, and this is just a Chanel Blue deodorant stick as well. Um, so I have that, um, and then I have a Chanel thing going on. Um, just my overpriced um, Chanel uh, chapstick, which I would never recommend to absolutely anyone um, ever, but I have that. <laughs> um, and then I have <clears throat> just my EpiPen, which I need that to not die. Um, but like I said, it's just kind of like one big open pouch, basically. Um, and I'll just grab this. That was just the lighting. Never mind. Close one. Um, uh, but <laughs> um, yeah, um, absolutely love this bag. Um, let me know if you guys want to see like a, <clears throat> like a Mark Cross collection video or Coach collection video or contemporary, but I don't know, designer, like luxury, I don't, you know, just let me know. Um, and I'm still trying to get the, my running one. I filmed it once and it just was not it. Um, I ran into a lot of problems, so I'll still keep trying on that one. Um, cause I'm just using like my phone, shocking, I know, um, as far as filming goes. Um, but Hopefully I'll get that to you guys. It's just been kind of a frustrating journal journey as far as that one goes. Um, so we'll have to see on that one. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You want to say hi, Scotch? Say hi to the lovely people. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, <clears throat> hope that you guys are starting off to have a good week and everything. And just know I'm thinking about you guys and praying for you and uh, stay, stay blessed.